My name is Frederick and I'm creative director from Frederick Samuelson and uh, Ron Satter. Hi, my name is Chinya Eze and I'm head designer for Frederick Samuelson and Ron Satter. Uh, it all started off with a, a competition uh, that uh, Samsonite had in a collaboration with uh, St. Martin's and then I won that competition and uh, I also was offered an internship at the head design office in, uh, which is situated in London. I didn't continue my internship there and, uh, and then I started my, my bag thing with the zippers because I just came up with the idea of having an expandable bag with zippers and uh, I also saw a, a big uh, I think gap in the market for really nice uh, leather products which is more for, a, for the young customer so they're not so much like the old school kind of leather brands. When you leave your house, you might yeah. have like a, a really big chunky bag, you know, with all the gym stuff and all the patterns and things for school. And then you just, when you go out in the evening, you don't want to come across yeah. like a, a mad person <laughs> in a bar. So then you can fold it up and you can leave some stuff at the office or in the studio. And that's also uh, how we came up with the kind of the expandable feature of, of a lot of the bags. Um, it's a small little village in, uh, in the mid-north part of Sweden, in the really you know, deep in the woodlands. Uh, for me, it's one of the most loveliest places in the world. It came natural, because I wanted to, to do something really Swedish, and I wanted uh, kind of to introduce this little village town throughout the whole world. Ran Search as a place comes through quite strongly. Um, through the brand and the bags just because of the the fact that it's all the leathers are completely natural it has this element of nature even with the colors and with the embossment of um, the actual brand is with the dogs and it's got this whole kind of free wild nature but it also has this kind of luxury feel to it where the place Ransetta when you actually do go there is it's so beautiful but it does have this air of kind of like not the French Riviera but of kind of a a Swedish version, lots of people spend their time at the country houses, so it does have this air of luxury, but still very simple and classic, and it's more about uh, simplicity sort of presented in a very luxurious way. I think always when you, when you go through a, a, a fashion council and they also help you to promote you and and with different kind of, they ask you different kinds of questions. It could be out about your brand or it could be about your company or your products that you might not even uh, have thought of before you enter the, the competition. So I think it's kind of uh, uh, to take down what their brand is really about and to think through that. And I, for us, it's, it's, uh, it's been very fun. I think press is so important to such a small brand like us just to make people even aware of who we are and that just that we're out there and stuff it's very very important to just keep us afloat and keep us and maybe we can afford to do a women's bag then <laughs>